morning, my beautiful internet friends. I'm super excited right now because I just realized that I accidentally life hacked my life. I, I mean, I feel like life hacked is probably over dramatic term for what you're about to see, but I work from home, right? I work from this desk right here and through that door right there that you see behind us is the restroom. And I drink a lot of water. I drink a lot of coffee, which means I'm sorry, maybe this is too much information, but I have to pee all the time. And it's really frustrating when every time I have to go to the bathroom, I have to either find crutches and maneuver over there like on my crutches and then like hold my crutches under my arm to like open the door and get through it and then like get through the other door in there, which I never do, or just strap on my eye walk, which takes a second and then I just have to take it off in there and then put it back on and then take it off when I get back over here or I hop, which hurts my foot. So none of the three options are my favorite, but like, you know, you make do. Not a big deal, whatever. Guys, this past weekend, I got a new chair. <laughs> also, you should probably shame me for the fact that it's taken me like four days to realize this, but whatever, check this out. Shepherd. It's raining outside. Are you super impressed? I am. It doesn't like fix all of the problems because there's still a lip that I have to go over there, but it cuts off half the journey. And guys, that's pretty exciting to me, as you might notice. I now just have to strategize the second half of the journey, and I think I'll just leave a pair of crutches in there. But I just want to let you guys know that rolling chairs are the best. Is this destroying my wood floors? Maybe. Is it worth it? Yes. Also, I often sit and work with the back door open because puppies, they like to run, which also accounts for my ridiculously dirty floors. Picture a world where I don't have to get up and hop or put on a crutch to close the door. I am queen of the world. Also, I just realized that you guys probably saw the fact that I wear like a decent shirt with just gym shorts because I only have to look like I'm put together from like here up for my job presently. I never really have to put real pants on, which means a lot of yoga pants and stretchy clothes happen, which I am not mad about. I just realized that what I'm using is a wheeled chair. It's just a chair that has wheels, Joe. It's a wheelchair. You're just using a wheelchair. Think that you're inventive and cool and hacking your life. But you know what, guys? We're gonna forget that fact and we're just gonna be excited about it. Ugh, to everyone telling me I should get a wheelchair for at home, uh, I just did. I just did. <laughs> this is like my friend who once was like, oh my God, Joe, you know what would be amazing? If they put french fries and cheese like together. <laughs> and I was like, chili cheese fries? You know, like they, they make those and her mind was blown. My wheeled chair is just a wheeled chair, but I'm still impressed with myself and that's what matters to me right now. Yeah, by the way, while we're talking about things that I'm just ridiculous at, like thinking, let's talk about the I set up for my puppies and no, this is not just a shameless plug for it. Uh, a couple days ago, I was real sick. Like I felt really bad all day. My body was in a lot of pain for no reason. I was laying down with all of the heating pads and I thought, well, I can't do anything. So maybe now is the day to finally set up an Instagram page for all of my pets. Cause people have been asking me that for a while. And I thought, you know, that'd be fun. They'd be like a great way to document their little journeys and all of that. And so I did it and I added up the pets that we have. That part is really important. I added them up and then I called it 28 paws and counting. And I felt very proud of myself because I thought that was a super cute name. And then I posted pictures to it and I tagged that account in like my normal account to link back to it. And I did like the at sign in, in different descriptions. So I did like some work for this, right? I did some work that would make it hard to change the name of the account. And I woke up the next morning and realized you should never do math when you're sick because I, it's 32, it's 32 paws. It's 32 paws and counting, but I can't change it now or rather I'm not going to. So there's my shameless, not shameless plug for my puppies and kitties Instagram page. So if you wanna see super cute pets, I mean, go there. Seriously, don't do math when you don't feel good because it's just, it's not gonna work out and you're gonna make public silly mistakes and then people are gonna call you out and be like, hey Joe, I think you mean 32 and you're gonna be like, no, I don't think that's what I meant. And then you're gonna wake up the next day and realize you were wrong all along. Long. Tip of the day for you. I love you guys. I'm thinking of you and I'll see you in the next video. Bye guys. Down the